Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone is doing well, staying safe. Anyway, so here to do my monthly pickups for the month of June. Um, figure since you know today's June 30th and uh, today's the last day of June, so go ahead and make my video. And um, got a pretty good amount of stuff this month, guys. So excited to show you what I got this month. And um, a bunch of 4Ks, some DVDs, some Twilight Times, some slipcovers and some non slipcovers. Um, some giveaway prizes came on um, this month. And some subscriber mail as well. And two early um, Christmas, Christmas, good lord, birthday presents. And um, that uh, my dad. I guess he gave it to me early, I guess. But, um, and I'm also expecting one more. Um, and that is Despicable Me 3 and 4K. So, um, so the only one I'll need is Minion. So I'll have all of them in 4K. So that's awesome. So let's go ahead and get started, guys. Um, I'm going to go and show you my, some DVDs first. I have three. And, um, got both, or two of these from Goodwill and one off Amazon. Okay, so, so the first one up. I don't know if this is if this has a Blu-ray release, but I've been trying to get this one for a long time. And we were at Goodwill. My dad actually showed me this. I'm like, oh my god, that's so cool. So um, that is a SpongeBob Christmas. I've been trying to get this one for a while, and I'm trying to find it, and I found it real cheap. So there's a SpongeBob Christmas. I haven't seen this one yet, but um, just to add it to the Christmas collection and uh, to the SpongeBob collection, it's really cool too. So um, can I wait to see this one? Uh, I'm not sure. I've never seen it before. But, um, I think it's been on TV, but I've never watched it. I think it came out in 2012, so, yeah. But, um, never seen it. I'm gonna read, read about it, guys. But, um, cannot wait to see this one real soon. I might just wait till Christmas time, or around December, and do it, like, for the 25 days of Christmas. But, um, just to have it for the Christmas collection is awesome. So, there's the SpongeBob Christmas. Alright, the next one up. Um, I actually saw this from the side, right here. When I saw Ryan Gosling, I had to pick it up. And I've never seen this movie, but I've already seen it. It was really good. Um, just, I love Ryan Gosling so much. He is such a great actor. Such an underrated actor, in my opinion. I love him. And that movie is Half Nelson. I actually found, like I said, I found this at Goodwill. Excellent movie. I love, love Ryan Gosling. This is from 2006. So, um, I've never heard of this movie before until I watched it. And, excellent movie, guys. If you haven't seen it, just give it a watch. It's a really good one, but, um, yeah, loved it. So, there's half a Nelson, if you want to read about it, guys. But, uh, just give it a watch. I think you, it's on Blu-ray, but it's really hard to find. It's, um, unavailable on Amazon. I think it's only, like, UK version or something, but, um, I don't think there's a US release of the Blu-ray of this one, so, we'll love to get the Blu-ray of that one. Okay, so the final one is a complete sixth season of SpongeBob. I'm trying to get all of these, but, um, now I have the first six seasons. I don't really care for the new seasons. They're kind of, eh. I love the the older ones. But um, now I need to get the seventh one. And um, I'm going to probably just end up getting all the seasons, guys. Just to have the whole collection. But um, yeah, so there's SpongeBob Season 6. Alright, so those are all my DVDs for this month. Okay, let's go ahead. Mm, I'll show you my two Twilight Time films. Which I've already watched. They're fantastic. Alright, so the first one up is... A movie with Jane Fonda and Robert De Niro, and that is Stanley and Iris. Huge surprise. It was amazing. I love this movie. Um, this was a blind buy for me because I've never seen it before. But uh, it was a cheap, it was one of those um, Twilight Time sales, um, going on a business sale. But it was like $7, I think. Excellent film, guys. If you haven't seen it, just give it a watch. Excellent film. Absolutely loved it. I can watch this again and again. It's such a great film. Okay, so the final Twilight Time film is a Paul Newman, um, Paul Newman, yeah, Paul Newman film, and, uh, this is another blind buy, and that is From the Terrace, excellent film as well, from 1960, excellent film, um, with his wife right there, so cool, so, um, yes, really enjoyed this film a lot, so those From the Terrace, so there's only two Twilight Time films this month, and I think this is, like, the last month for Twilight Time, which sucks, Okay, let's go ahead and show you my subcovers, and then I'll do my 4K slides, okay? Alright, so the first one up is The Hobbit, The Battle of the Five Armies. Love this slipcover. Um, cannot wait to see every single one of these. And um, maybe one day we'll get a 4K release of these, and then the, that in the Lord, of the, Lord of the Rings. 
but that'd be really cool. So, cannot wait to see these. So excited, but I love the slip on that, guys. It's absolutely gorgeous. So, there's a Hobbit, the Battle of the Five Armies. All right, so next one, I found this at Goodwill. Surprisingly, this was an excellent film with Chadwick Boseman and Harrison Ford, and that is 42, the Jackie Robinson story. I found it with a slip, even though the slip is not in that great of a condition, but um, just, had, just to have it added to the collection was awesome. But um, excellent, excellent baseball film. I mean, Chadwick Boseman is an excellent actor. Just love him so much, guys. But um, if you haven't seen it, give it a watch. It was excellent. Okay, next one up. I haven't seen this yet. Um, that is The Addams Family. Like I showed you in my last video, I actually have the second one. I always wanted to get this one. Never could find it at Best Buy anywhere. But luckily, Target finally put it out um, a couple weeks ago, and I picked it up. So now I have both. There's Adam's family. Okay. Oh, I didn't show you the back, guys. I'm sorry. Cannot wait to see both of those back to back. All right. So this is one of the giveaway prizes I won in April. But as soon as I won it, all this pandemic stuff happened. I wasn't able to get it until recently. And I already had the movie in 4K. And that is Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker. Gorgeous slip on this. But um, just to have the Blu ray edition, because I love the cover on the Blu ray more than I do the 4K. But um, yeah, awesome movie, guys. Oh, here's the back if you want to read about it. I did enjoy this one. I really did. Okay, this was a blind buy for me as well. Found this at Walmart. Last one they had with a slip. And I'm like, oh my god, this is probably not going to be any good. It's going to be trash. I thought this movie was absolutely hilarious. And that is The Boss with Melissa McCarthy. This movie had me rolling. I thought this movie was hilarious. She is so funny in this. Um, and uh, Kristen, Kristen Bell... If you haven't seen this movie, guys, please get it. It is freaking hilarious. I absolutely loved it. I can see myself watching this again. Just excellent. Ugh, loved it. No, it's not perfect, but it's just funny. Okay, so the final one that I found, um, I found this at Big Lots, and I love Sip on it, and that is Noah. I did watch this one the other day. It was okay. It wasn't like, eh, it's all right. Um, it's got Jennifer Connelly in here, Naomi Watts. Emmy Watts, Emma Watts, I keep saying Emmy Watts, Emma Watts, it was okay, it looked really good on Blu-ray though, I bet that would look fantastic in 4K, so there's all my Blu-rays guys, okay, let's go on and move on to my non-slips, I'll show you, well, let me go and show you the one did you bug I picked up, I actually found this at Big Lots as well, and that is Fifty Shades Darker, um, like I guess it's a did you book, um, I just picked it up because I like did you books a lot, and, um, and did you packs, I really like those, even though the movie is probably not good, um, I need to get the other two, but I just had to pick it up. It was $5, and uh, I really like the cover on it as well. Really shiny. Love it. I need to watch these, but I've um, heard they're not really that great, but we'll see. Okay, so one of my lovely subscribers, two lovely subscribers, sent me something. All right, so the first one up um, is the... Hobbit trilogy and the Lord of the Rings trilogy. So happy to finally add these to the collection. Like I said in my last video, I really want to get the extended editions of these as well. But I'm um, so freaking excited to have these in my collection. Like I said, it's all six films. But uh, yes, so, so excited. Thank you so much again for the lovely, lovely gift. It's amazing. Okay, next one up is one of my favorite movies. And that is the original Point Break. A lot of these subscribers sent me to send me this as well. I mean, so cool. Just to have um, subscribers send you something that's really nice. And really thoughtful and generous. But um, like I said, I absolutely love this film. Wish this would come to 4K. I mean, I know the new one's in 4K. But, uh, but um, they need to bring this one to 4K ASAP. But I uh, absolutely love that film. Uh, next up, I found this at Goodwill. Um, that is... Beer Fest. I actually watched this one. It was okay. It wasn't really that funny. I had a few kind of hilarious scenes, but oh no, it was kind of stupid. But it was a dollar. Can't beat it. So yes, it was. It was okay. All right. Actually, I found this at Goodwill, and that is the Hobbit Unexpected Journey. I got this one before the subscriber sent me the other one, but I'm so glad to finally add this one to the collection as well. Okay. Next one up is now you see me which was it was okay i do absolutely love the second one it's really good this one was okay all right next one up is runaway bride um kind of like the spinoff to pretty woman pretty woman is one of my all-time favorite movies i absolutely love it this one was pretty good pretty decent all right next one up 
is American Pie 2. I need to get every single one of these in Blu-ray or on Blu-ray. Um, I don't really want to get the other ones. I just want to get this one, the first one, the third one, or American Reunion, American Wedding. That's the only ones that I really want. I don't really want those other ones. It's like spin-off type ones. They're kind of stupid, but just the original ones I love. So they're just funny. They're just really, really for fun. You know, just to laugh. Okay, next one up is Patriots Games with Harrison Ford. Excellent, excellent film from 1992. But um, I absolutely love this one. I love Harrison Ford so much. He is such a phenomenal actor. Just to love it. So those Patriots Games. All right, so the final one without a slip, and that is Turns of Endearment. Excellent. Oh, my God. This movie was freaking amazing. I loved it. So heartwarming, especially the ending. Uh, oh, the, the ending got me, guys. But um, Shirley MacLaine, Deborah Winger, Jack Nicholson, please go to watch if you haven't seen it. But, um, yeah, I found that uh, that Big Lots for $3, I think. So, um, yeah. All right, guys. So those are all my non-slips. Okay. Let's go ahead and move on to my 4Ks. Okay. All right, last category, guys, in the 4Ks, all right? Okay, now I already have the first one. I've been trying to get the second one for a while, and I found it a bit at Best Buy. Best Buy is doing these, like, a bin for, like, $12.99 4Ks. That's amazing. So I finally picked up um, the Huntsman, the Winter's War. Like I said, I had the first one, and I need to get the second one to slip. So um, this one was pretty good. I like the first one a little bit more. But um, this looked absolutely fantastic in 4K. But I now have both of them with slips. That's so cool. But um, it was pretty decent. Pretty decent. But like I said, I like the first one a lot more. Okay. And then I picked up Despicable Me 2 with a slip at Best Buy, which is freaking amazing. Like I said, I got the third one coming with a slip. Um, then I'll need to get the first uh, first one with a slip cover because I have it without a slip. And I need to get Minions with a slip, and I'll have all of them. So that's pretty cool. So, um, like I said before, this is my favorite Despicable Me movie. I absolutely love this film. I was actually watching this one the other day. These look fantastic in 4K, guys. Absolutely incredible. But, um, like I said, just love this movie so much, guys. Alright, next one up is Incredibles 2. My dad was actually, he actually traded me this time. I've been trying, trying to get him to trade me this one. Because I traded him my Target exclusive for this one. And he felt so bad about trading it to me that um, for Father's Day, we ended up going to Best Buy, my mom and I, and we got him another copy. So now he has the Target exclusive and this one. So he's happy, and I'm happy because I have this one. So um, even though this movie wasn't as good, just to have both with slips is awesome. The first one is an absolute classic, but that one's okay. Okay, next one up, guys. I finally watched this one, and I finally picked up the 4K edition, and that is Parasite. Um, this was okay. It wasn't, like, my favorite movie of um, last year, but um, it was pretty decent. I need to watch it again, but um, I did kind of enjoy it. Um, I love the um, the way it was shot. It was really cool. So, um, it was it was pretty good. I did kind of enjoy it. I, mean, I probably need to watch it again, but um, I just don't really care for the subtitles that mu as much. But uh, it was all right. Here's Parasite. Okay, these are my three giveaway prizes on Instagram, and that is War of the Worlds, Top Gun, and Days of Thunder. Like I said, I won these from Films at Home on Instagram. I will link his channel down below, guys. He is absolutely fantastic. But um, I finally watched Top Gun and Days of Thunder. I've seen this one before. Uh, like I said before, I didn't really care for this one the second time I watched it. It was all right. It wasn't as good as I remembered it to be. But um, then I watched this one. This was fantastic. I love Top Gun. But um, it looked incredible in 4K. And then I finally watched this one as well. I love this movie as well. This movie in 4K. They cleaned it up so well. Um, I just had to finally add these to the 4K collection. Yes. So freaking excited. They're just fantastic. Okay. We have three more to go, guys. All right. Next one up. Um, I've seen this at Walmart so many times, just never picked it up, but I finally picked it up because it's the last one they had with a slip, and I didn't want to mess up on this beautiful slip cover, and that is The Birth of a Nation. Like I said, it just opens up like this, guys. But, um, I watched this movie. It was really good. Really powerful. Um, so yes, I did enjoy this movie a lot, and, um, really kind of hard to watch some of the scenes, but it was really, really good. But, um, I love this slip. It's got a really nice matte or soft velvet touch to it. 
But um, yeah, so there's Birth of a Nation, or the Birth of a Nation, I'm sorry. Alright, next one up, I finally picked this up on 4K. Found it at Walmart with a slip for $15, and that is Annihilation. I love this movie. This movie in 4K was incredible. But um, Oscar Isaac is one of my favorite actors right now. He is absolutely incredible, especially in the Star Wars movies. And he's been in other movies as well. And Natalie Portman, I love her so much. But um, yeah, beautiful slip on this. Absolutely beautiful. Um, I think they, did they make a still book of this? I can't remember, but I'm so glad to finally add it to the 4K collection. All right, so the final movie is my favorite movie of all time. And that is Jaws, Lone Tickler. I put it in one of those silver book covers, little plastic covers. But uh, yes, absolutely love this film, guys. Just to finally have the 4K of this movie. This movie in 4K was absolutely f phenomenal. They cleaned this movie up so well. Um, just to finally add it to the 4K collection. Oh, it's Lone Tickler, guys. It's got a book in there and everything. It's really neat. And I'm so, so happy to add it to the 4K collection. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. So those are all of my movies this month. And um, we were going to go out today, but we didn't. And I was going to plan on picking up a few more movies for this month, but we didn't go anywhere. We stayed home. So, um, yeah, I think we might get out tomorrow. I'm not exactly sure. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. So make sure to like this video, comment down below. What do you think of my pickups for this month? Or let me know down in the comments, what did you get this month? Um, yeah, I guess that's pretty much it, guys. So make sure to like this video, comment down below. Make sure to subscribe to my channel. Can't ever say that word, right, guys? Subscribe to my channel. I guess I will talk to you next time. Bye.